Well, hey guys, welcome to the Daily Bits. I'm glad you're here, glad you're stopping by. I wanted to chime in on the Irish Demon Chili email thing that's going on. Now, I was watching the live stream with Irish Demon, uh, and he had um, uh, another another guy named Colin. I believe I met him before uh, when they came to Ironton. Um, this, that, was a, that was last year sometime. And anyways... Uh, we know, but Chili likes to say some pretty fucked up things, um, and then tries to say it's defamation if you say something back to him and he threatens to sue you. Uh, it's it's the same thing every time. Every time if you, he says, "Hey, you're a piece of shit" or "fat," and you're like, "Oh, well, you're a fucking idiot." Oh, I'm going to sue you because that's defamation. Uh, Chili likes to do this. Um, if if you're a subscriber of Chili. And you listen to this. I, I I don't understand why you're following to begin with. You would figure that somebody that wishes cancer, bone cancer, on children. I I, I mean, it, it, here's the thing. If if you're supporting Chile, you're ultimately supporting somebody that wishes bone cancer on children. And you got to ask yourself: Do you want children to die from bone cancer? Do you? Do you do do you do you? You want children to die from bone cancer? Do you have children? You need to think about that. You need to think about that. There's proof of that out there. It's not defamation when it's true. Uh, anyways, anyways, we do have stuff like that. Chili likes to say he's the tough guy. He likes to pretend to be the tough guy when, in fact, he's not. Um, case in point, we had uh, Chad. I I'm repeating history as it happened. Uh, we had him come to Ironton where... He was making some trouble, and I actually confronted him. Uh, he stood like like this to me, and he threatened to have sex with me on camera, which we do have footage of that. Uh, he, he, he seems to think that dominating men is a good thing. Now, I'm not here to kink shame. You can dominate all the men you want. Uh, you're allowed to do that. Um, being gay is fine. You're, you're allowed to do that. Um, but you know, don't hide it. Don't, don't hide it. Uh, but anyways, anyways, I want to talk about these emails. I want to talk about the emails. I'm not going to show them. I probably put a thumbnail uh, to show you guys what it said. Let's just go ahead and talk about the main things. Now, number one, Ch Chili went after Irish Demon's girl, uh, by saying some terrible things like calling her a, a whore or, uh, saying that he's going to show her what a real man can do to her, and her being on her knees. You know what he's implying? He's implying that he's going to take advantage or rape her. In my opinion, I can't prove that now, but I can prove that that was said in the thing. He did say that she was a whore, that she, he was going to show her what a real man's like. Now, I, I don't I don't know about you. Chili doesn't like women very well, so he likes to threaten women, especially women that fight back. He he can't handle that. If a woman stands up for anything, he freaks the fuck out. Um he just can't handle it. He just cannot handle a woman having the upper hand. Um here's the thing. Irish Demon's uh girlfriend did not fucking deserve that. Um who are you to call somebody a whore? Who are you? Who are you? Are you? You say you're a visionary in the emails. He said he was a visionary. He had a mission. He's going to be the governor, but didn't know how to spell the governor. Uh, you figure if you're going to be the governor, you know how to spell governor. I don't know. I know grammatical errors happen. I do it all the time. Uh, but for real, if you're going to be a governor, learn how to fucking spell it at least. And, you know, telling some girl that you don't know. Uh, that you're, you know, she's a whore and you're going to show her what a real man can. Dude, you're not, a, you're not tough. You're not tough. We proved that. We've proved it so many times. And nobody in their right minds is going to drive all the way or fly all the way to wherever the fuck you are in California or Nevada. I, I don't know where the fuck you are. Uh, nobody's going to want to fight you because as soon as they get there, you're going to run away. This happened. This happened before, people. This happened before. We had a sanctioned fight to help children with cancer. It was a charity fight with a police officer. Chili ran his mouth, said he can fight. He's a badass. He's a visionary. He's got a mission. And he can fight any man and dominate any man any way he likes. Because he's the fucking alpha dog. He ran away from this days before the fight. 
days before the fight. If you guys don't believe me, go back on the history. You can actually watch this. Uh, Chile also says things like it's going to take a lot of people to hold him down and to put him in torture cuffs. This happened live where he got arrested. One cop, torture cuffs. Didn't take five, took one, took one, and he cried the whole time. Chili, you can't you can't tell people you can't you know pretend you're a tough guy and say I'm going to sue you for defamation. He already said he was going to sue uh, Irish's girlfriend for saying he wears makeup. Dude, you fucking wear makeup if you don't fucking prove it. It's not defamation when it's true, in my opinion. Guys, let me go ahead and tell you this is all my opinion. I can't prove it. Fuck you, Chili. Just my opinion. Just my opinion. Um, yeah, go fuck yourself. But really, really, you wear makeup. You can fucking see it. We're not stupid. You you can see it. Dude, I remember seeing a video with your eyes puffed up from the Botox injections. Don't fucking lie to people. Just let people know that you're a fucking cross-dressing bitch. Just let people know. They want the truth. Please, calm on Paris Hilton. Please, please get the chihuahua out of your ass or Charlie or Charlie. Please give him somebody will take care of Charlie. But Paris Hilton, please, please. Now, he said he was going to fight Irish demon. He was going to dominate Irish demon. He said he's going to pound him into the ground. He wants him to fly down to fight him in a ring and in, in, in the gym <laughs> yeah, that, that's funny. That's funny. That's fucking funny, dude. That's funny. It how how do you expect somebody to fight you and you're afraid to take up fights that you already offered people? You're not the tough guy. I could fight you and I'd easily beat your fucking ass. Very easily. That's not a joke. That's true. That's a fact. That's not defamation. That's truth. And it'll set you free free one day. It'll set you free if you actually you know, told the truth, you fucking lying bitch. But, you know, outside of telling people that, you know, they want their kids to die from uh, bone cancer and pretending he's an alpha fighter, uh, pretending he's the supreme mega O governor or whatever the fuck he is, saying that he's the fastest growing channel on YouTube when the fact is he is buying some subs. He's buying subs. He's buying subs. He's buying subs, in my opinion. He's buying subs. There's no fucking way that you have 360,000 some people watching your videos. Well, not watching. Subscribe. I'm sorry. You're, you've never had that many people watch. You might have got lucky on some of your shorts, but you are buying them. You, you Dude, dude, statistics doesn't lie. Math, it could be wrong sometimes. But it doesn't lie. It doesn't lie. You can't tell me you have, you know, 300 some thousand people that subscribes to you and you can only get maybe 400 people in your lives or maybe 4,000 people watching your videos. And you're saying you're the fastest growing YouTube channel. You're not. You're not. You're not. It just fuck you, please. Now, that's not even the worst part of it. Um, I don't know what. Chili's thing is, if you know, you're a detractor of him, um, he wishes awful things on people. Like, like I said, if we were going back to him wishing that you, as a viewer, that's a detractor, and your child to have cancer, he also wished Irish and his girlfriend to die from a plane crash. Now, you're a governor. You're wanting to be the governor. You want to be a visionary. I don't think that's going to compute too well, you stupid fuck. It, it it doesn't. It doesn't. It really doesn't. Just think about it. Just think about it. I want you two people that do not like me that call out my bullshit. I want you two to die on an airplane crash. By the way, the other people that's on the airplane, they get to die too. I don't care about them. Fuck those people. They should die too. All of them should die. And I'm going to piss on their ashes. That's not reaching. That's true. You wishing somebody to die from an airplane crash. There's more people on the airplane than just those two. You don't care about those people, though. You don't. As long as those two are 
gone and you could piss on their ashes uh, to fill so you can jerk off into some kind of Botox injection you can put in your fucking eyeballs. Uh, dude, fuck you. Like, for real. For real. And, guys, you don't have to look very far. Go on Irish Demon's channel. Watch the previous lives. It's all there. This motherfucker wrote this shit. This guy that you follow, and by by the way, if you follow him and you support him, give him money, you're supporting somebody that's okay with domestic violence. It's okay if that. He's okay with your children dying from bone cancer. He's okay if rape. He's okay with people dying from airplane crashes. He's okay with being a racist. He's okay to mock women and shove women. He likes to do these things, in my opinion. Oh, again, it's all my opinion. But he fucking loves his shit. He's a fucking liar. He's a piece of shit. Yo, I don't know Iris very well. I got to meet him, but I like him. He was a nice guy. He wasn't a fat guy. I'm the fat guy. I'm the fat guy, remember? I'm the fat guy that stood up to you at Ironton. And you cowered away. You and your fucking Mark Twain looking bastard that called me fat. The you know the one that uh, that was had his head so far up your ass he could smell your f upper intestine. That guy, you know that fucker. Dude, you're not tough. You're not. You're an embarrassment. You don't have a mission. The only mission you have is bumming money from people so you don't have to work a legit job. What do you contribute to the society? Next thing I know it, you and people like you, these frauditors are going to want vets, vets, like actual vet benefits. You're going to be like, oh, I'm fighting a war at home. I want veteran benefits. That's not a stretch. I'm seeing that happening. That can happen. You're saying you're fighting some kind of war at home. There's no fucking war at home. The only war there is is seeing how many dicks you can stuff in your mouth without choking. And I'm sure it does a quite a bit. I hate to be disgusting. I hate to be rude. But hearing somebody talking to a woman like that, telling somebody to die, pretending to be a big shot when they ran away from a charity fight for children with cancer, that really fucking bothers me. That really does. Again, you... Again, if you're coming on here and you're coming to bitch and be like, oh, but Chili's the greatest, just remember what you what he represents, what he's okay with, and then ask yourself, do I really want to support this guy? Do, 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 do you? Honestly. I'm going to leave it at that because I kind of rambled for way too long. Guys, I love you very much. I'll see you soon.